Woods. Can you pick one more pick? I got a bunch. Jeez. Snow, but I got, I got a bunch. <laughs> Stung on the hand. Oh. <laughs> what? <laughs> Do you hear that? Wait, wait. wait. <sighs> You're gonna hurt yourself. <laughs> matches the sun. This matches the grass. Yeah, the grass is dying. That's sick, Joe. Do the fish like that when it matches the grass? You need to pick this up. What are you doing? Can you even see? Moses needs to see. Keeps the summer. <laughs> So cool, just like watching them run. They're so graceful. I'm just trying to be quiet. They're pretty good at being quiet. Wow. Watch, cool. watch out, meat eater. We're coming for you. <laughs> there honestly could be more. Like, oh, there's a marmot. <gasps> I see him. Who cares about the marmot? You see him, Phil? Oh, he's looking right at him. Dang, Joe, what are your thoughts on the wildlife? It's pretty cool just rolling up on that, you know? We kind of scared him up, and they just started running. You guys are ridiculous. It's a sick picture. <laughs> <laughs> Wait till the end. We gotta, you gotta take it back still too. Oh, I'm just your little tent slave. <laughs> no, I'll say, I'll say thanks at the end. That was good. That was good for the first part, but gonna hold you to it. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks for carrying the tent. Whose tent was it? My tent. Why did I carry your tent and not mine? Because I have physical limitations.
Yeah, I'll take it. thing is huge dude this is probably like a two footer at least we're just chopping these wedges and then phil's go working on the fire we're gonna get the fire going and then we're just gonna cook them it's already pre-smoked so it's, it's got some flavor it's pretty good nice responsible fire folks responsible. Yeah, it's, really mm, it's gonna be good What do you want me to say? Waiting for your review. Oh. Those are just your honest thoughts. Alright. Uh, yeah, so what we got here is, uh, we got Polish sausage, well, smoked sausage, but pretty much the same thing. And then we got some onions that we, you know, seared pretty good. Both sides cooked pretty evenly. We call this the Polish custard. Uh, if you are ever familiar with the pierogi, they're a uh, Polish dish and it tastes just like that. Uh, it just takes me back to my days, you know. Shout out to all the Polish people out there. It's a very simple way to eat well in the wilderness. Just buy those big sausages, bring a bag of onions, and then Phil put a little spin on it with that rice, a little twist. That is crazy. Look at the color on that thing, man. Dang. It's a beautiful brookie. Oh, yeah. Where's the fire? Okay. Get him, let him go, Joe. Yeah. That was on the mosquito. Put it right in front of him and smacked it. He look, yeah, he looked at he it. He looked for... at it for like five seconds. Can you get like a picture of it? Ah, whatever. Uh, just let him go. That was a cool fish. Sweet. Sick collar, man. He's still looking. He's still hungry. <laughs> Went from Poland to urban America. Wherever chickens are from. <laughs> yeah, everywhere. There's not much fire for it. Uh -huh. That's really ready. You put a lot in there, Phil. I know. I'm gonna... Well, I think that's some of the best chicken I've like ever made myself. Like, I don't know what it is. We use the steak juice. And we cook it in the steak juice. Then we put onions and a little bit of salt and Phil's secret sauce. That's some, that's some good chicken, man. That's, that's really good chicken, man. Feels decent. 
Yeah, this one's a little bigger. Nah, it's a little small. This is a nice one, Michael. Really? Okay. Try to film me if I can. Ooh, Brookie. Whoops. Yeah, Brookie. Oh, dude. One more. Yeah, there he is. Your face. You gonna pick one more pick? I got a bunch. Good. Ah, he's good. That's good. That was a nice one, man. <laughs> On Sunday. Nice net. Beautiful. Dang. Oh, I'm all wet now. Chill, chill. He took the little, took the little dragonfly. Cute little 